What's up, everybody? Welcome to another episode of $20 Chef. Today, listen, I used to live in Long Beach, all right? One of my favorite deep fried foods that I used to get at this place called Louis Burger was the deep fried zucchini. All right, they put it in a box this big and they just load it slam full of deep fried zucchini strips and they put two fat ass things of ranch in it and it's heaven. It's a legit dish and not many people are really fucking with fried zucchini. They do a lot more in the round version. I'm going sticks on them. The key here when you want to be a deep fried guy at the house, you got to have three matching bowls. Look, these are like five bucks. They're silver bowls because you obviously you got to have your breadcrumbs, your flour, your cornstarch mix, and your egg or milk when you're deep frying shit. You know what I mean? Now, I got my flour. I'm going to throw a little cayenne in there, give it a little heat. I don't know the recipe of, of Louis Burger, but I'm going to throw a little oregano in there. All right, not too much. And make sure when you're putting spices on stuff, get a smell of it. Every time you do it every time, before you throw them in, a little basil, then you'll have a little bit of a, you know, you start to get a little palate on you. Look at you with your palate. Sophisticated palate, know your smells and tastes and shit. So here we go, mix up your flour. So I put a little cornstarch in here too. I put salt and pepper in my eggs as well. Remember, when you're whisking, this is when you wanna ask people in your house questions. This makes you a multitasker and it makes you feel better about what you're doing. You got the eggs in there, you're like, yo, Ryan, what's the spread on the Jets game? And it's always gonna be plus a lot. Okay, now you're a multitasking ass. He's got really well whisked eggs and you got some breadcrumbs. Now with this, you could go a lot of direction. I'm going straight plain breadcrumbs, okay? Let's go ahead and start cutting up our zucchini. I'm doing sticks. You could do little circles if you want to, but the, you know, when Louis Burger in Long Beach, they do sticks. I get a box of the sticks, I'm pumped. This weekend, some funny shit happened to me and it made me think like how many times this was true. I was hanging out with my girlfriend and like in the middle of something, I said, oh, I forgot what I was gonna say. And she looked at me and said, no, no, you didn't forget. That's just the universe telling you to shut your ass up. And that was a really good answer. I'm like, how many times have I said I forgot what I was gonna say and somebody was happy I didn't remember. All right, so the key here is before you go deep frying shit, you gotta run it through the mill here. You get them all nice and coated up, nice and breaded up. You put them on here, you put your sticks in the refrigerator for at least 10 minutes. Chemically, some shit pops off, then you deep fry them. For whatever reason, them shits come out a little crispier and more delicious. All right, showtime. I'm gonna go gloves on this one. All right, again, don't forget, I bought, found a box of these rubber gloves at a 99 cent store when I was stoned. Who's up? All right, remember, zucchini. Flour, nice flour coat, right into our egg. Get the egg all over it, right into the breadcrumbs. I'll tell you what, I went hiking with my girlfriend this last weekend. I'm not a big hiker, that's a relationship thing. We saw another couple. Later on in the hike, we saw the couple, but the girl was not there, it was just the dude. And I went from having a fun time to thinking I was about to be a goddamn key witness in a murder trial. And he kept on doing this shit when we were behind him, like he was walking. And he kept on looking and even got to the point where he turned around like this and looked at us. I started looking for a nice sized stick, a rock. If you go on a hike with your lady and you come back alone and people notice, it's a problem. All right, these are looking good. I'm pretty excited about these. Budget on this one, way under the radar. Zucchini's super cheap. It's like a buck, it's less than $2 a pound. So, I mean, if you don't have the breadcrumbs, even a can of the breadcrumbs is only a couple of bucks. Flour and the egg, obviously, we're looking at a really cheap uh, operation here. Now you got them all set, ready to rock and roll. Drop them in the fridge, let them cool down for a hot minute. You can let those cool for 10 minutes to an hour, whatever you feel like doing. I don't have an hour, so I'm gonna get my oil rocking. This is gonna take a little bit of time and get nice and hot. You know, it's funny having a lazy eye because uh, a lot of things happen that you don't ever really think about. Like when I go to a restaurant, I have to place myself strategically at the table. If it's a two top against the wall, I have to be on the side where my lazy eye touches the wall. Like here's the wall, here's the table. I have to sit here so my eye goes here. Because what happens is when I sit on this side and then my lazy eye's out here in the wild of the restaurant, then you got another table over there. They're trying to enjoy their dinner. They're looking at this guy and all they see is this eyeball coming at him from table 12. It's a big problem. If it's a dude with testosterone issues, he thinks I'm fucking mad dogging him. There's a lot going on there with a lazy eye. You straight eye fucks got it really good and you don't even know it. All right, just pour myself a nice little beer because when you're doing deep fry action, it's gonna get a little hot in the kitchen. You wanna stay good and cool down, you know what I mean? All right, so well, yeah, we've had our, our sticks in here cooling for like 20 minutes. This is what we're working with. Now, I normally, if this is just me by myself, not doing a show, I'd probably make twice as much as this because I'm a fat piece of shit. And I do fat piece of shit stuff like quadruple down on deep fried foods when I'm at home alone. All right, here we go. These are only gonna go in for about two minutes or so. Don't put too many in at one time. It'll bring the temperature down to the oil and then you're gonna be fucking yourself. You already smell that zucchini cooking up nice. Getting nice and brown real quick. Look at that. All right, these guys are done. Two minutes flat. Get them over here on your paper towel. Let that grease get off a little bit. 
Now, this has nothing to do with this, but I really love jalapeno, so I want to make this a little bit spicy of a dish for myself. I'm going jalapeno because that's how I am. And that's it. I mean, you get a little cup, put your ranch in there. Wonderfully, easily breaded, long ass, delicious, underrated, deep fried zucchini sticks. Listen, you got your own cup of ranch, you can quadruple dip if you want. So don't worry about that shit. This is all you. You get in there with that zucchini when it's nice and hot, cool it down with some of that ranch. Nice and crispy, delicious, half-ass healthy in some weird way. Go buy yourself some zucchini, get you some breadcrumbs and a fucking six-pack. That's just episode of $20 Chef. See you guys next time.